What's up everybody, my name is Pipo Teixeira from Groove Drum Company and I'm here today to show you a video, another video of the pancake drums, of the Groove Drum Company pancake drums but in different tunings so I get a lot of messages and emails about this about how versatile it is to tune it in different ways and I believe uh, it's uh, very versatile so um, I've tuned these drums right now in the best, the, uh, best way, the sweet spot of the drums, each drum has the sweet spot, but it's very versatile to tune it low. That's where people ask me if it goes low. And it goes very low, as I will uh, show you. Uh, as I told, um, these are tuned in the sweet spot right now. I won't uh, tune the bass drum because I will explain you why. I always put an Evan Z mad on these bass drums and the Evans Z-Mad is not a super versatile drum, it's for the low, low pitch side of the tuning. So if you want to uh, change the, the way the head sounds in this, in this bass drum, you, you can try a single ply head, for instance, if you play a higher pitch uh, or a higher tuning, you can uh, do a, a, a single ply head with a, a ring, so you can have uh, more uh, bottom and um, sustain, but this head, with this muffle, with this sponge that has uh, on the diameter of the head, will allow you always to have a lower pitch. So I will tune um, the toms and the snare drum uh, to show you how low it can go and how versatile it is. So I'll show you right now how the drum sounds uh, in this sweet spot. Okay, so this is the sweet spot of the drum, where it sounds the most, uh, the, the, the full potential of the drums. And now I'll show you how to go down even the snare drum. People are very afraid of the 12 inch snare drum. They always think that is a higher pitch snare drum. And I, I always tell that the lower pitch or the higher pitch or the, uh, the lower note or the higher note has nothing to do with diameter to do with thickness so this is a very thin drum so as thin as it is it goes down uh, going low fre frequencies right so if I have a thicker cymbal higher pitch a thinner cymbal lower pitch thicker drum higher pitch thinner drum lower pitch so this is a very thin five millimeter thin snare drum so it can go very low uh, uh, no worries if you close your eyes and listen to this drum in a low uh, tuning you will not notice it's a 12 inch you will notice like a 13 or 14 inch so what I do always to tune the drums in a, a easier way is I that, that I put the drums all up with two drum keys so it can go from the center to the tips in a, a parallel way right it's the best way to tune that that's the way I tune and then I go low and see if everything is okay but right now I won't listen to the drum I, I will just use two drum keys and go down the drum in a parallel way so you can listen how low it goes. So I'm going to a medium tuning right now, a little bit low. Let's go. Now the snare drum. Oh, and this is a, a 8 lug 12 inch snare drum, not a 6. Right, let's do it. When 
a little bit lower as you can see the the, the toms get a little bit of, bit of bottom, bottom more bottom so i will tune right now let's go down Snare drum. Right? Maybe I have to adjust a little bit uh, the snare wire because as the head goes down, the snare wire vibrates a little bit more. Let's see. Yeah, just a little bit. I'll take the drum keys from here. There rattling a little bit so let's go Maybe I'll go a little bit more. It's almost on the super low, but I'll go a little bit more. Let's go. Yeah, this is the final stage. But I will show you how it goes up again after this tuning. So a little bit low. Let's go. Okay. Yeah. Okay. As you can see, this is really low. So, I will show you right now. Let's put again what it was. So, two drum keys. Let's go up, up, up. Yeah, now the snare. You want to listen to it? Upper. Let's go to the really funk stuff. Let's do it. Yeah. Yeah. As you can see, it's even upper than the sweet spot and it sounds amazing still. So as you can see, uh, this is a, a video I want to show you so you can listen how versatile and how easy it is to tune. So you have a per perfect edge, perfect shell, uh, fin shell, it works amazing as you can see. You just have to use two drum keys, no need to blah 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 because the drum is perfectly even. Uh, so. It's easier to tune, it's easier to take in one bag. We'll be launching in a couple of weeks the new carrying bags, so uh, be sure to, to follow us in the Instagram and Facebook. So thank you very much, bye-bye. This is Pipo Teixeira from Groove Drum Company.